What's up, guys? And before we get into the video, make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment, hit like that bell notification. Go to my YouTube since it's only a small percentage. You guys are actually subscribed, so make sure you guys hit that shit, guys. Hit that bell notification. Damn. What's up, guys? Okay. <sighs> yeah, so these are my friends, Jonathan. What's up, bitch? And hey. Justin. We're going back, we're going to school. We have a lot of classes today. So it's, we're gonna be stuck in the classroom for a long time, but hopefully we're, I'm gonna try to make it fun for you guys. And yeah, let's see how it goes. You wanna say hi? Hello. STC. This is where I pass out. Oh my god, there's so many people. Oh Hello. Hey. Hello, guys. <laughs> Yo. We're in class now. And there's no seats for us. Yo. Yeah. Hey. Hello. Hey, I'm going to be playing Yo, with the vlog? Yo, what's up, man? Let's go. <laughs> What's up? Vlog for YouTube? Yo, yeah. You're first day back, bro. This first day back? Yeah. So we start off the day with our digital circuits class in which we were learning about combinational circuits and sequential circuits and how we could store information using something called flip-flops. No, not those, but these. Overall, it was a very interesting class, although I did not understand anything the teacher was saying. Now we have one Math 119, which is our calculus class, and it's just videos that are posted, so we can do anything we want, basically. And we have like around an hour before our next class. Hello. What's your name? Ivan. Ivan, okay. Ivan, what's your favorite part about Waterloo Software Engineering? I love when I go to class, and I don't understand any of the content that just happened. Uh, none of them. I hate this program. So what are we doing, guys? I can't do work. Actually, okay, I see. So you're doing 119. Wow, I see you have done no questions. Nothing. 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 <laughs> right, Navi? Um, What's the best restaurant in water? Um, oh. Oh, that's a good one. That, I, that should be easy to answer. It's an easy? My food, right? You, you never, you never let me eat your food. Oh, wait, I never? No. <laughs> oh. Sure. I said, do you have food? You're like, not for you. <laughs> Day's been pretty good, you know? I I was, I was had to do an interview in the middle of class. Oh, just, really? Just walked right out. How you know? did it go? It, it went pretty well. The guy was like, what's machine learning? And, you know, you gotta hit them with uh, artificial intelligence. Okay. Are you gonna like zoom in on my... Uh... So next up, we have our ECE 140 class, which is our linear circuits class. Uh, in this class, we learn about uh, how different circuits work, but more importantly, you realize how pathetic you are in life. I got I know, I tried to blast it. So now we're gonna go get lunch, and then we have more classes in the afternoon, right? Yes. Peace! Oh boy. That's your phone, let's go. I'm just gonna like, our drive. Go, go, go! <laughs> kebab shack was it was good food and now we have like a lecture i think or a tutorial. i think we skipped like two lectures but like that's all right <laughs> i've been at 12 30 yeah, yeah. my friend that's tough we're halfway through right now oh so yeah, we're going home tough. then yeah we're going home <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah. Why don't you fake something? <laughs> oh, let's get yo, it out. Yo, yo, this is not good content. I was gonna go to class again. Oh, you wait, 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 Come to Kebab Shack. It's actually delicious. The price is cheap, the food is good, and most importantly, it's a place that you celebrate with your friends and just have a good time. They should give me money. They should give me money because I'm, nice I'm promoting them. Like, True. yo, it's actually True. so good though. Hello. Oh my. I was gonna come here. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so update. We're just trying to find a room here in E7 because, yeah, there's students here everywhere and there. There's no space to study, so do we have a place? <laughs> Get some exercise. Yeah, my feet hurt. <laughs> Trying to get some work done on EC 106, which is our ENM course, because yeah, we spent some time eating, so I'm just trying to focus. Now for our ENM course, the entire class is online, so we basically just have to watch a bunch of uh, videos. So we basically have to either attend these online lectures or watch them afterwards asynchronously. So over here, I'm just re-watching the videos uh, at 2x speed. Now I'd say by far our toughest class is our e &M class, at least for me personally. Like even though I did learn e &M in high school, the difficulty of the problems in, in this class are much higher because we need to use so many different equations at the same time. We need to relate magnetic force with electric force and use like integrals to solve different problems, which really wasn't uh, a thing back in high school. So I'd say this class is the most difficult for most people. Unless you were, of course, one of these guys. If you go from here to there, that's zero. If you go from here to there, that's zero. Yeah. So the the no, no, potential. No, no, no. Wait, so is the potential on both sides zero? I don't know, man. The only thing I know is that I have zero potential. Okay, see you guys. Alright, peace. Peace, peace, guys. Alright, so we are finally going home. Gonna get some food. I have a coffee chat at around 6 p.m. Uh, so I'm just gonna go home really quickly. Now, one of the great things about Waterloo is that everything is just so close together. So I literally can just walk home. I don't need to take the metro or the bus, anything. I mean, I have supermarkets, there's restaurants here. There's really everything. So I really like that about Waterloo. All right, so I'm back at the apartment. It's 5.37 p.m. I'm gonna grab some food quickly before a coffee chat that I have around 6 p.m. that I set up with someone. Man, today was so busy. I didn't have time to actually sit down and properly chat with you guys, but I'm hoping my voiceover is gonna do a good job. All right? I got you, bro. Yeah. yeah. All right, hello. <laughs> All right, so I just had my coffee chat with Amy. It was, it was great. So now I'm gonna get some more work done before heading out in about 20 minutes to go doing machining. Uh, this is for the robotics team. That's gonna be really fun. All right, we just have arrived at the bay. I'm in the robotics room. I'm running a bit late. I have uh, one part that I have to machine today. It's not gonna take long, like probably 50 minutes max. Uh, just cutting it down to size. So let's go ahead and do that. And I'll show you guys this later during the night. Yeah, yeah, may happen to Willie. I got some homies in Philly. They're digging holes in the city. He getting busy. He really wanted to really get homies up back in the city. Back in the village. Yeah, now we're getting giddy. I swear we ain't popping the pillies. That ain't a gimme. I ain't gonna show my Achilles. I'm making the best in the city. I'm picking lilies. If I'm a mama who pretty, she won't get to make it so easy. I'm talking deep. Nothing her changing so much that they're growing up living the dream. He like she wanna live, but then they came and took it too quick. I ain't a bitch. If I ever meet the reaper, go book on his limbs and get the fuck up on my dick and making me sick to my stomach. Thinking about being a puppet. Show me a book by a power who likes.
about to kill all of a sudden Picking and making me kick in the bucket Leaving me up on the summit I don't even know how to balance a budget I need a so I finished machining, took me around an hour. But essentially what I was doing is cutting this down by five millimeters because it was just a bit too long. But I had to do this uh, for six of them and I think it turned out good. At the end, uh, to clean up, I deburred it. I used, I don't even know what the name of the tools are because I'm, I'm still learning, but yeah, it was pretty fun. So now it's shorter by five millimeters. So that's what I did today. But yeah, outside of school, I am involved in student design teams. So this is one of them. So this part of the area is called the Bay. It hosts a few dozen student design teams. And essentially these are like independent teams that compete in competitions. So the one I'm in is the robotics one and we compete on the Mars Rover challenge. Essentially it's like a robot that would theoretically work on Mars. And we have a bunch of tasks we need to accomplish. And so we need to build a robot for that and the best team wins. So it's really fun. It's so nice that we have our own designated area for that. We call it the Bay. Uh, the official name, I think, is the Student Cedra Design Center, but just call it the Bay. Uh, that's what the Waterloo students here call it. And I'm part of the mechanical sub team within this team. And what I do is essentially I can do catting and I also con contribute to machining. Highly encourage you guys to join. It's amazing fun. You get to meet really cool people and you get to work on robots. So. Uh, this is a dream come true. Now tonight I'm all by myself and that's totally fine. Uh, usually we have team meetings that happens on virtually because of the whole COVID situation. Some people are still like working remotely. So that's why tonight I just needed to get this task done and I guess I have the whole area to myself. So that's great and I can talk to you guys. That's all, I will be heading back home now and getting some rest because today was a very long day, but it was really fun. I'm so happy that I decided to make this video today. So yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Uh, a sequential circuit, goodbye, is one that does not occur at once. So normally, like electricity, pretty fast, right? It moves pretty quickly. So like when you put the inputs, if you just have your whole circuit with that sequential circuit, it's just gonna be done. So when you wanna have something like that, you need to use a sequential circuit where one thing happens.